Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will try to protect the routes. So if the user is authenticated, so when we need to allow the users and when we not to allow the links. So let's try to do it in this video. So now here, if I try to click on the post, I am able to get the post details. If I am trying to refresh also, I am able to get the, I am not able to get the post details. So now what is the issue? So let's try to see. First, what is what is this? Now, when the user is not logged in, we, need, we should not show this link, right? So, when the user is when the user is not logged in, we should not show this link. Let's hide this link. So, for example, here, when the user is not logged in, also we are showing the post. So, let's hide this link. Now, here, what I will try to do is, so I will open and I will close this one, okay? And here, what I can do, I can write this one like this. Now, post has been disappeared now if i try to see the post here i am able to see the post uh, uh, it's it's going away to the login so it's fine so because of the dispatch logout thing fine now i will try to login leela webdev at the rate gmail.com and one two three four five six seven eight nine zero okay so this is the so now when i try to see the post i am able to see and if i try to refresh also i am not able to see the post page so what is happening here Let's try to see. Now, if you try to see, let's go to the app.js here. In this app.js, now first I need to add the protected routes. So, which are the routes which should be allowed, which are the routes are not allowed. Let's try to see. So, now here I will get to, I will get the state map state to props is equal to state. So, and here I will be returning the value something like is authenticated okay is authenticated sorry authenticated is equal to stay sorry is authenticated of state now we got the is authenticated now here i let's try to connect here connect map state to props okay and also this app now what i will try to do is here Connect. Yeah. What I will try to do is, I will I will try to have one variable. Let routes is equal to. I will take this all the switch thing. Okay. So I will paste it here. Now, if props dot is authenticated, if props is authenticated, then again I will copy this all the things. And I will paste it here. So now these are the routes. Now which is the route? So here normally this one is not allowed. And here this route is also not allowed. Okay. Up to here it is okay. Fine. And here these two routes are not allowed. Okay. So these are the routes which should be shown when authenticated. These are the routes not authenticated. Now I can directly take this one and I can directly add it here. So routes. I think most probably that's it. So now we are creating in a condition in such a way that if it is authenticated only, only these routes should be loaded. And if it is not authenticated, these, these routes should be loaded. Now, if I try to see the post page, okay. So, when I try to refresh this post page, it is going to the, so now we are able to see the post thing. So, now here we are able to see the post. So, previously we are not able to see, now we are able to see. Home page, if I try to refresh, I am able to see the home page. If I try to refresh the post page, I am able to see the post page also. Now, what is the thing I need to do? So, let's try to access the sign up. If I try to access the sign up, what is happening here? It is going to the home page. So, what is the thing we need to do here? So, here we can write something like exact. If anything matches, just redirect. Other than this, just redirect. Or otherwise, what we can write is what we can write is here exact is there, right? So, anything matches here. Let's go to the home page. Let's write, write redirect to is equal to slash. Okay. So this is the thing I'm, I will be trying to do. Now here, let's try to redirect here. Okay. Now I will try to take the post and here I will try to click on the sign up. So what is happening here? See, it is directly going away to the home page. So this is the thing I need it. So here if I click on the login. It is going away to the home page. Yeah. So now if I click on the post, I am able to see the post. If I try to refresh this page, I am, able, I am still able to see the post page also. So now we have successfully did this one. So whenever I try to access this login page, 
it will go to the home page why because i don't have the access for the login page why because the user is already logged in now if i click on the login so i am able to see the login page if i try to refresh so now i am able to see the login page again so here I, if i try to access the post page it goes to the login fine so sign up page and home page everything is working fine so if i try to access the post page again so nothing not a problem so login page is accessed so i need to log in so it is telling that to access the post page you need to log in okay fine so i will go to the login page here yeah okay i am able to see the home page i will go to the log post page if i try to refresh the post page i am able to get the posts again so i will try to access the sign up page sign up it will go to the home page perfect so it, if i try to access the login page it will go to the home page yeah so this is how we can do the protected routing thing so here what we have did if user is authenticated only then we are accessing the routes other than that we are redirecting it to the home page that means when the user tries to log in uh, press the login if the user is authenticated simply we will move it to the home home page okay so this is how we will be doing the uh, routes guarding route guarding so route guarding in the React.js you will be having the simple route guarding is like this so if you want means you can also write in every component in the component in mode you can check the is authenticated or otherwise you can push it to the login page or push it to somewhere also you can do it or otherwise as a route guarding also we can do it like this hope you understood about this uh, routing uh, guarding thing so up to here we have did all the concepts here so if you try to see i have able to log in so we have did the login and uh, we have we are almost all authentication everything is completed the react.js this is all about the react.js concept actually so now we have implemented the router we have implemented the post page so we are able to see the view details edit details delete post create post we are able to do the create post let's try to see the create post so yeah create post is working view details is working edit details is working delete post is also working so fine right so everything is working so now when i access when i try to access again the login page okay it is going away to home page fine when i access to the view in the view detail something like login here so same thing it will go to the home page fine it's perfect so everything is working so i can move i can click on the logout okay so if i try to access the create post here it should go to the login yeah so everything is working fine so hope you understood about the routing concept so authentication concept everything so we have did all the concepts in the redux so this is all about the uh, redux concepts how to access the redux and also the authentication in the redux also we have protected the routes also most of the things everything is completed this is about the um, authentication in the react router if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you